Hey guys, it's In Spray and Pray Nick here, and today is Thursday, March the 12th at 10:20 p.m. This video is is going to be the review for the aluminum leather edge case from Purporta, and this video will not be going up until probably tomorrow, which is Friday the 13th, around midnight or two o'clock in the morning. Around that time will be when it's going to go up. But let's get into this review. All right, first impressions I had on this case, you saw in that video, is the the leather feels really nice, and it feels great in the hand, guys. It feels it feels really good in the hand. It also has the lay on the table design, to where you don't have to worry about your bevel getting scratched. It has great drop protection on the front, the back, and bottom, but not on the top, because as you guys can see, the chrome, or the stainless steel, is sticking out all along the top, which is one thing I don't like. I wish Purporta would have made it all the way around like that, would have made, sorry about that, kind of knocked the camera, would have made this go all the way up to here, so you can protect the rest of this metal, because I don't want any dents in my iPod. I don't want any scratches. I don't want any dents. I want to keep my iPod in pristine condition like I just got it from the store. I don't want anything going wrong with it. And this case doesn't really do that. But, but I don't throw my iPod all over the place. I only do this when I get home. And then I go do my homework. Or when I pick it up, I drop it and be clumsy like that. I've never had it land right there. I've been lucky enough to not have it land right there. So anyway, as you can see on the outside here, it's got this nice tan stripe looking thing going around the side in white. And it has a nice red piece of leather on the end, which gives a nice look with that red piece of leather. And as you open it up on the inside, you can feel it's metal, aluminum on the inside. You open it up, and there's that Purporta, the name Purporta, right there on the inside, which is a really, really nice feature. This thing also doubles as a stand this way. It doesn't work if you want to go sideways. It won't stand up sideways, but it will stand up straight up, stand straight up and work, which is a nice feature for me. Now, on the inside, underneath your iPod, to keep your iPod getting any scratches there is felt nice felt on the inside and there is no flash on the inside of here no flash from when the felt meets the, meets the leather in the metal no flash at all so you don't even have to worry you don't even have to take a microfiber real quick wipe the back of your iPod and then throw it in the case because there's no lint in it and there's nothing on the inside that's going to scratch your iPod iPod because this case is made really well. And it's it's not going to slide out of this case, guys. You can shake it as hard as you want. It's not going to come out of here. Because it is a tight fit. It's so tight you can't put a bodyguards or a best skins ever or a zag on it. If you have the zag on, you can leave the zag or the bodyguards or the best skins ever if you have those on. You can leave your screen shield on, but you have to take the back off. It's just not going to fit. It's either going to stretch your case out, or it's going to get your iPod stuck in the case, and you won't be able to get it out. You're going to have to cut your case just to get get your iPod out, and the case is metal, so it's not going to cut with a pair of scissors. So it's just it's just going to be be really hard to get it out. Now on the outside, again on the back, you can see there's a little uh, that's a little thing for you you, you if you have a lanyard. What I used, I did use this clip, by the way. I used one of these. A little hinge clip, but one that's about half the size of this. I don't know what I did with it. It's probably downstairs, and I didn't have time to go find it before I did this video. But I did. I took it, and I ran it through. This one will not fit, but I ran it through. Oh, yeah, it will. I ran it through, and I just hung it from my belt. Belt loop. And... I used it like that with the air drive headphones with a little button to change the songs and 
and everything, which worked great. I like it like that. I would use this case like that. Except for the fact that it doesn't cover the sides. That kills me. The fact that it doesn't cover the sides. Because if I leave this, and I have this little clip on here, and it decides it's going to swing over the side, or like this, it's going to scratch my iPod. If this was covered, that wouldn't happen. That's why I say before that, guys, you need to take and extend this up to about here so you get that extra protection on the outside. And it might actually make the case look cooler. I, I mean, I really like the look now. Extending the, the sides might make it look worse, was what I meant to say. might make it look worse for style, but it would help in protection. I, personally, me, am looking for a case that has good protection like the MK slider, but this is now my favorite case. This is my lineup here. Guys, hold on. My case, this one got stuck. This is my lineup, guys. Of the little line leather case, leather edge case from Laporta, leather stop protective case from Laporta, and the MK slider. Now, whenever I go to school, this is going to always be on my iPod now. Now, until I get, maybe if I get another case or if I get a bodyguards. This is on my iPod, this is at home, and this is in my book bag. Along with this sitting on the inside side of it. My microfiber is always in here, folded in my bag. And if I feel like I want a little bit more protection, I'll take this case off. Take this case off, throw that in my bag. Take that off, slide the MK slider on, and wear the MK slider the rest of the day. But this is my new favorite case. So guys, I really think you guys should go check out Purporta.com. There's going to be a link in the video description over here. Again, a link in the video description over that way. So click on it. Go check out Purporta.com. They have some great product. And again, thanks again, Purporta, for sending me product that you sent. Let's just get a line up of the product that I received from, from Purporta. Show you guys everything that I've gotten from them so far. They're, they've been so nice. It's such a great company. They have great product. They sent me the aluminum line edge case, leather edge case, the leather style protective case, and the soft feel silicone case, which is in the giveaway, guys. Don't forget about the giveaway. Three cases. Three winners. The wave case with a screen shield and the body glove with a screen shield along with the soft feel silicone case from Purporta. Natalie, if you don't mind, I'm going to give this case away. Give this, be giving this case away. And you're going to get this for my winner, by the way. You're going to get this with everything that it came with. It's, it didn't really come with anything except one of those little iPod inserts, but I'm going to go ahead and stick that back in here. This case is barely used, and it's a great, great case. They're all great cases in the giveaway. Remember, guys, go to either one of my giveaways and type in giveaway slash your comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Maybe you can even rate. I don't know. But don't forget to subscribe to my videos. Okay, guys, I'm running on eight minutes. Don't forget about the giveaway again. I've got to, I've got to get out of here, though, guys. This has been in Spray and Pray Nick with a, vi with a video for you guys. Alright guys, I'm out of here. Peace.